All right, let's continue the farm from one warrior game to another. <sighs> All right. I'm not going to touch anything until it loads. I'm not touching anything. There we go. All right, it's loaded. Now I can go back to my browser and make sure everything's running smoothly. Okay. Uh, oh, we're up to summer already. Man. Hey, you. It's the first and busiest day of the season. Good luck today. I'll make dinner tonight. Don't worry. Okay. Oh, yeah, right. I fainted at the end of yesterday. That's fine. All right. Uh, I need... Where's the doggo fish? How are we looking? Okay, I mean, nearly there. It's just one more part. Oh, these grow as well in summer. I guess I don't have to cut them down. I mean, I, I could be lazy here and just be like the first... I don't know how many days, just go with this just to save time. And I think I might just do that. There's nothing wrong with it. Oh, the coffee's in the other one. I'm an idiot. Uh, uh, scythe, watering can. Alright, let's go. Wait, what's that supposed to be? Oh, doggo. In the corner of my eye, it just looked like it was a mouth, that emoji. Like something laughing? I don't know. I thought I did something wrong for a sec. Like, what? What have I done? The season's barely started. How have I already done something wrong? <laughs> it's okay. See, emojis like that are just so hard to see. I wish I would do what, what Discord does, which, like, if it's only an emoji in a message, just send it bigger. That'd be cool. This happens every year, by the way, like... I edit my end of year video, and then I end up doing something where I'm like, man... Regretting, like, putting it out, but whatever, it's fine. There's enough content where I say the word dick or penis in that video, so... It's fine. Can do without it.
I will probably still have to go to Pierre's because I think I only have enough to fill two. It's the warrior voice that makes you laugh extra. Yeah. I know. I've also figured that I can technically do Waluigi's voice, it's just... I'm not exactly sure how I could do it. The only the only way that I'm going to do that voice naturally... Um... Yeah, Bojack, Wajack. Oh shit, I may have put this in a bad spot. But yeah, I mean, Waluigi's voice just, is just Wario's voice, but more nasally, so I can do that. But the problem is Waluigi doesn't really have games. He just makes appearances. There you go. Let's get the expensive stuff out of the way. I'm gonna get a lot of red cabbage. Um, I think we definitely just need to do a lot of these, so that's gonna be 24. Um, hops along the bottom. I can't remember how much is required. So I'm just gonna grab 30. Same with this. Same with this. I don't think we need to do wheat at all. Okay, sure. I mean, that's fine. Uh, I mean, get that. I guess we're done. Oh, no, wait, the sunflower. Okay. Now we're done. While I'm here... Kind of figured. Twenty-five gold star vegetables. Perfect, because it's like, it's the whole season. So we can do this. This is going to be easy. Although, he says vegetable, right? So I guess we have to have vegetables. Um, I'm not going to have this debate. What's the cheapest vegetable I can get here? Tomato is not a vegetable. Corn, cabbage. We're going to spam the cabbage, yes! <laughs> not today, but like, in that other spot where I did that field. We're gonna put a hundred there. For now, we'll start here, and then wh whatever we have time for. Okay, um, so... I will put corn here. So that's gonna be fine. Oh, radish seeds. Um, it's okay, I have some left over, so that's good. The thing is, I don't think I need to grow them right now. I think I'll go with just the expensive stuff, so. You know, do the melon. And here, I guess what I'll do is I'll divide it, I'll be like, pep, and then 
Blueberry is the other one. Yeah. Okay. And then here. Pops all the way along. Okay. Now, this is going to be a little awkward. Oh, maybe it won't be. Maybe I can do this. Spangle. Two, three, four. And then... It's the last one. Aren't there two flowers? Did I not buy it? It was Poppy. I didn't buy Poppy. It's not too late to go get it. Unless I have some here. Mm, doesn't look like it. Okay, back in a sec. Yeah, honestly, one of the very first things I'm going to focus on is the, uh, the flute for the horse. Because I just always leave the horse somewhere and then I forget. Um. Yeah, I mean, that should be enough, I think. Mm-mm-mm. <laughs> Okay, the most important thing is to water, and then if I have time, I will do the fertilizer stuff. Go. Uh, where are they? Yeah. I mean, there's not going to be a perfect balance, but it'll look good. And then sunflower here. Okay. Yeah, I might have to start doing chests dedicated to seasons. Um, it's okay. See, I have another chest that I can take out. Just put it here, and then just load a few more seeds in here. Okay, uh, what am I gonna do? Just thinking. Fertilizer? Yeah, fertilizer. I probably need more.
I will probably miss a spot. <laughs> Knowing me. I'll do my best not to, but no guarantee. Okay, uh, let's put more wine on. Okay, just checking, <laughs> just making sure. All right. Um, the animals will not have gotten pets, unfortunately, but it is what it is. Sorry. Mine and neglect. It's all right, it's just one day. I'm trying to sleep. Okay. I do believe we're sorted, so duck feathers, I'll keep them, because Bee Chipster likes them. And once that's done, I can just sell them. I wonder what I can get away with here. There's still a little bit of time left. I think, at the very least, I should be able to clear whatever junk is here. Oh, there's none. Wow, that's surprising. Do this so then I don't have to tomorrow. Then I can just plant everything here. Leave it be. I'll be back tomorrow.
I think I did everything I needed to do. I always thought I'd be alone my whole life. I'm happy we found each other, silly. <laughs> Hold on. Ugh, I forgot to do that last night. Yeah, so here's the problem I face. I guess it's not too bad, like, I just go out this way. It's fine. Oh, yeah. We gotta have this now. I think I need more seaweed. I think I'll go to the ocean fish because I need to get a puff fish anyway. So that'll probably be what I'm doing today after I do the farming stuff. Which is in town. Might still need the hose, so I'll have to bring it. Um, and make sure the watering can is full as well. I don't think we need the scythe. I think the scythe can stay. Alright, let's go. Um, yeah, I mean... I'm gonna take coffee for Harvey. George, I think, just needs one more. I guess these are, like, the presents that I should be giving out, and then... Um, I think I have flowers still in here. Yeah, I mean, let's just take these generically. That should be enough. Alright, let's go. Um, I'll bring my horse. Like, the minecart would be quicker, but I think... Ah, oh, worry, I was just about to write you a letter. Eh? You see, my, rec my records indicate that you're due for your annual checkup. That checkup. Now, now, there's no need to worry. It'll be quick and painless. Please follow me. Okay, hold still, please. Say ah. Uh. Ah! Uh. Okay, you can stop. I just need to check your vitals. Hmm, your pulse is a little high. Eh? Uh. My diet consists of garlic. What do you want from me? I'm out of breath from working on the farm. Okay, that makes sense. Well then, you seem very healthy, warrior. Just make sure not to overwork yourself on that farm. Thanks for stopping in. I was supposed to gift you. 
Coffee. Okay, good. Friendship is progressing. I need to catch up to this kid. Claire mentioned something. I like this, thanks. Uh, I don't know if you like this. That's your nurse, have you? Okay. Then we're okay. I'm gonna pop in and give a flower to Gunther as well, because... I haven't really made friends with him. That is thoughtful of you. Okay, and now... Clint. Um, is that it with Clint? No, not, not quite. I think I already got that. Yep. Uh, this is a new one. Hmm. Ah, oh, hello there. I'm finishing up an iridium-infused sword for a monster hunter from Castle Village. You might have heard of him. He goes by the name Scyther. Castle Village is home to the best monster slayers and artisans in the world. It's not much, but it's honest work. Right now, I'm not getting any orders from the Adventurers Guild here in Stardew Valley. When there were more monsters, there was a steady demand for new weapons. The guild used to be a lot bigger, but they've lost some good people over the years. The summit has gotten crowded. Sorry, Warrior, I didn't mean to bring that up, especially with you being a guild member and all. What should I say? We all accepted the risks when we joined. I look up to you, Adventure Guild members. You keep everyone safe from monsters. Warrior, you've made excellent strides in protecting the valley from monsters while also building up an impressive farm. I envy that. I'm not brave enough to fight monsters. But I do what I can to ensure the safety of those who do. That's why I pride myself in my smithing work. I know I'm a bit awkward sometimes, Oreo, but thanks for stopping by. I need to get back to finishing this sword. I'll see you next time you drop by, or maybe at the saloon. Have a rusty spoon. Nah, he's not gonna like that. Okay. I guess let's just lay out a hundred. Merry Quasmas? Merry Quasmas too. <laughs> Hello, mushroom. I was gonna read that as Merry Quasimodo, but... I don't think that's like as a universal reference. Wait, really? Did I- oh no, because of- yeah. Yeah, yeah, I got it, I got it. Because of the Scarecrow. I mean, I, I could move it, but eh. And then just lay down the fertilizer, and hopefully that'll be enough for PS thing.
Alright, that'll do. How many do we need? I mean, between what I have on the farm and here, it should be enough. To get 25. Uh, cheers for the follow, I appreciate that. Did I miss a spot? <laughs> it's like, it's midnight here, so, you know, excuse if I did. I'm pretty sure I didn't. Uh, don't worry about Gus for now. Okay, there you go. Still haven't maxed that one out yet. Where's Granny? Oh, she's at Doctor. Uh, that's not going to happen in time. I hate when they do that. They request, at the start of the season, a crop that's never going to be done in the first week. Here you go. I mean, I guess if you have it in the greenhouse, but like... It's kind of unlikely. Yeah, a big one. Hi, Warrior. I'm looking at these starfish in the water. Look at this bright orange one. You probably came here to pick up some coral or sea urchins, huh? What should I say? Sorry about the tide pools, wanted to say hi. I like ocean creatures a lot. These tide pools allow me to get a good close look at all sorts of them. Willie said you fixed the wooden bridge leading to this part of the beach. I never got the chance to, um... I never thanked you for that. My dad built that wooden bridge years ago so I could visit the tide pools during the summer. It got damaged during a storm so I couldn't get over here without swimming. With my dad being away, no one bothered to fix the bridge. But you fixed it. No one even asked you to, but you did it anyway. Hmm? I wish my dad would spend more time with me. Since my dad got home, he isn't the same. Him being away for an entire year was really hard. I'm so happy he's back, but it isn't the same. I don't feel like looking at starfish anymore. I'm I'm gonna go. Bye. Damn kid. I should check on Vincent later today. Uh I mean Oh Rainbow Shell! <laughs> okay. I can do the gambling thing. Yes! I mean, I would imagine... Is he home yet? No. Um... Uh, but like... I'll try to talk to him. I'm wasting the day. Oh, hi. Um, don't tell my dad about what I said, okay? Mom said I need to be careful what I tell him. Vincent looks sad. Okay. Uh, can we... Try this? Like, ice cream? Yeah. For me? Wow, thanks. It doesn't say he's sad anymore, so...
But I got the feeling I still have to go over later. Have a fish. Okay. Oh, good. Alright, he's hit Iridium. Where is he? I guess I'll fish at like 6.30 and go see him at his house. Okay, hold on. I'll check the wiki when these puffer fish are here. Okay, it is from 12 to 4 p.m., so I guess we're done here. <laughs> I knew it was going to be something like that. Fine. All right, I have to come back tomorrow. This is what happens when you're social. You just, you don't achieve your goals. I'm kidding, by the way. In the context of the game, however, I am not. <laughs> Gift her this since she's coming up this way anyway. There you go. I don't need it, just climb on. I'm gonna check the expanded wick and see what other fish are like available. First things first, please tell me we can go in there. Okay, good. Oh my goodness. All right, there we go. Come on. There's something at the end there. Oh, I'm excited about my trip to the Fern Islands. I had to save up a lot of money to go, but it'll be worth it. The culture and architecture will be a spectacular experience, not to mention the beautiful weather and beaches. Pages of a diary. Emerald Farm Manifest for the 39th quarter. I guess it's set in 1993. Expenses, income, profit. Hmm. I wonder if this, it's locked tight. There's a trap door. Ooh. Wait, there's another note there. I saw it. Assembly instructions, page five. One by four by, what the heck is this? One by four by 49. And then half an inch? No? That's a quote. That's a quote. That dash one. So one, one by four by 49. One 18 by one by two. Assemble top by drilling pocket holes as shown. And I don't think this is anything. Okay, it says what it is at the bottom to make a storage test. This one. Okay. 
10 baits inside the mayor's fridge, which we can do now if we're quick enough. Wait, what? Really? <laughs> but like, what's... That, that side of the map is empty. Oh, I mean, it depends what time it closes. Doesn't say. Okay, uh, ten beats. Guess it has to be these. And since I'm going to Lewis's, take him the spicy pep. Wait, what am I doing? <laughs> That's not it. I bet it closes at eight. No, it's here. Okay, cool. Um, excuse me, I have to get to your fridge. Good job. Give the sand dragon this last meal. Okay. Um, that's fine. We can do that today. Here you go. Um, that's friendship with Lewis done. It may have already been done. And then it's time to gamble, yes! No, but for real, like, I'm gonna spend some time gambling. <laughs> it might suck to watch. But, I mean... That is what it is. Okay, uh, Solar Essence, and... What do we got? I feel like I should have run into it already. Uh-oh. There it is. Okay. You prune yourself, check the pile of lumber next to your house, okay. Then it'll be available from tomorrow. I think I needed to say that seaweed, but whatever, it's fine. Uh, okay. Oh, chicken statue's in the way. That's kind of funny. Okay, we've made it. Uh, let me just check on the greenhouse real quick. Uh-huh. Um, oh, that grew. Cool. I guess I have time to plant. Okay, I've already shipped 15.
Uh, I have no idea where the rhubarb is stacked. I'm gonna put cabbage in the greenhouse. Maybe I haven't stuck that yet. Oh no, here it is. Okay, move it back and I'm gonna take it over so then I can make like wine or something out of it. Uh, take a doggo fish so then I can gift it in the morning. Yeah, you're finally up. Craving something for breakfast? There's so many weeds to remove from the vineyard. Okay, uh, here. Okay, I'm gonna go fishing for the puffer fish, and then after that, casino gambling. The apple trees have gotta be close to b being done, surely. I need another cheese press, yeah. <laughs> it's definitely out of control. that I have water. I also need to start loading these crab pots. I keep forgetting. This is such an awkward lake, but... Dude. Okay, there we go.
I can't remember what I need from fresh water. It might be that I'm up to... Yeah, maybe I am up to... Seawater. Okay. I might start doing that tomorrow. Just talk. I lived in Pelican Town my whole life. Can you believe that? Time to go fish. It really doesn't leave me a lot of time to fish. I'm hoping it's enough. Maybe I should do the fishing first. How incredible. I think this is a new one. Ahoy there, Wario. I just landed a real whopper. Here, let me show you. Crimson fish. This beauty is called a crimson fish. They're a rare species that's disappearing from these parts, sadly. There's a notion going around that they're dying off on account of the recent pollution from Georgia. Since their factories started cropping up across the Ferngill Republic, crimson fish populations have dropped off. Just extra lore. I was just about to release her. I don't want to put these rare treasures in any more danger than they are already, even though I could make some good coins selling her. Sure, I'm happy I'm able to show her to someone. People don't believe my fish stories. I forgot to bring a present for him. At times like these, I feel like I should invest in purchasing a camera. So, how's the fishing life been treating you? That is marvelous to hear, Warrior. I gave you my old fishing rod to get you started. I never imagined you'd turn out to be such a skilled angler. If you squint, you can just about see the Fern Islands across the ocean on a nice day like this. My family is from those islands. We should take a boat out there sometimes. Away from the cities, the water is crystal clear, and there are some amazing rare fish that are native to the islands. The ring fruit grown on the islands are also delicious, so I've been craving a good ring fruit lately. I'm going to keep an angling and toss the crimson fish back so she can go on her way. Have a pleasant day, warrior. Okay. Oh, yeah, causes you to get off your horse. I gotta start making an effort with the beach hipster as well. I think I got like roughly two minutes to try this.
Come on. Ah. I'm not going to get it. <laughs> On. Thirty seconds. Nah. Oh, it was at four, not two. Okay, I have a couple minutes left then. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Hopefully we can land one. Seaweed. <laughs> it's raw and ocean fishing. I'm probably not going to get it. <laughs> okay, I got it. Oh, thank fuck. Um, the question is, is it using recipes? I'm not sure. I might have to look it up, but I'm going to try and get a second one since I'm here. And then that way I don't have to think. I think even Demetrius asked for one, so I might just need a second one anyway. But I doubt I'll get it today. Okay, it might still... No, it's not this one. Not moving erratic. Oh, wow. Okay. Damn. Okay, it's casino time. Um, casino time. Yeah, look. <laughs> it's probably... It's not gonna be super enjoyable, but... The flip side... Is if I do do this, I'll be able to just teleport home whenever I want, and that's amazing. So, you know, it's gonna make things way better. But I'm aware that the, the downside is, is quite extreme. Oh, selling like Lynx Tunic, that's cool. Be gone. Yes! Okay, uh, one of these gives you starter coins. I have a statue of endless fortune for one million, no thank you. 
I'm on a roll. Who does it? This table's for big shots. A thousand coin per bit. That's new. There's a high roller table. Coleco Jack. There's Blackjack as well. It's good to finally meet you, kid. Welcome to my exclusive clubhouse. You've got the spark. That's why I singled you out. What spark? Ah, the conduit of mystery, of art. People like us have a responsibility to keep the world alive, to give folks a, a taste of the extraordinary. You see, kid, the world is like a bowl of rice. It's got substance, but it ain't worth nothing without a good, zesty sauce. That's where we come in. Didn't you ever wonder who put treasure chests in the mine, old mine shaft? I like to give people surprises. You'll understand someday. Just keep doing your best and never give up. Alright. Uh... Yeah, we're gonna have a budget of 100 initially and... Okay. Let's just... So, I hope everyone's uh, Christmas is going well. I had a pretty nice one hanging out with the family. But, you know, that was yesterday. Um, as we do stuff on the 24th, much like a lot of countries in the world. It's just, I guess, America, the UK, and... I guess anywhere that's, like, been colonized by them, more or less do it on the 25th. So, but today was chill. I mean, everything's more or less quiet. People are at home doing their thing. I finished editing the end of year highlight video, which is out on YouTube now. If you haven't seen it, it's on the uh, highlights channel. Uh, it was pretty fun to edit this year's one. So. If you want to see some of my favorite moments and stuff that you may have missed out on, it's a good one to check out. It is a bit long, but I've divided it into chapters, so if you want to jump to a particular game, you can. But, you know. Watching the whole thing's also good. <laughs> I have to wait until I hit, like, about 300, and then I can do, like, a, a gamble. This is going pretty well. I don't want to, like, get overzealous and bet the, the 100. Okay, I'm betting the 100 now. Come on. Okay. We did okay. Now we're kind of in the green. One more. Okay, there we go, there we go, there we go. We got our buffer. <laughs> Don't gamble, kids! <laughs> it's not like this at all. Oh, come on. Okay. If only you could chart, like, the money on the fly. Yes! Okay, good. Alright, and now, now we're comfortable. Yes! 
Okay, now now we can't go down. It is only up, upwards, through the stratosphere. <laughs> I should change the title of the stream, like Slot Simulator. It's a good thing that time pauses as well when you're in this, so... I don't have to check the clock. I might check out the new games just for shits and giggles, but not yet. Because I can earn everything I need from these, unless they've changed the payout rate of this. I don't know. I usually have horrendous luck with this, for whatever reason. Like, it takes me ages to get the big one. But it does eventually happen. Just have to be patient. Bad habit. It's going up, that's the important part. As long as the money is rising. Pretty much once I get the star drop, that lets me get enough teleport, but, like, typically two is what I go for. Because then, that's it, you, you don't have to worry, like, you'll, you can just keep teleporting home whenever, like, it's no biggie. In fact, I will use it, like, on a day-to-day -day basis, like, if I go to feed the animals on the left, I'll teleport back to the right, because it's just quicker. And we'll probably save you a whole minute. And the advantage is like staying up late. <sighs> Damn it. That was almost three in a row. Hey, I don't have a problem. You have a problem. Leave me alone. Warrior's gambling problem. I keep getting the... the parsnip. Over and over again. Oh, come on. <laughs> that would have been a good one. The other thing is, I guess, hardwood fences is nice as well. It's just a bunch of stuff that then it'll just make this easier to play. I just need one of the, like, 
bottom three jackpots. And that gets the ball rolling. It'll happen eventually. It just needs to stop giving me this. Damn, I should have put a counter. I've seen people get this, like, within the first ten minutes, and it's kind of nuts. I just have chaotic luck. Gambling stream, you know it. Yes! Got to love that dopamine directly into my cock. Yes! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I'm in a weird mood. It's been, I've been doing the warrior voice too much lately. He just needs to win and then we can leave. Ah, oh, nearly. Come on. Teasing. Yeah, yeah, keep keep doing it. Keep keep doing it. Keep doing it. Two, 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 two. This is pretty much just for the totems. It just makes life great. Because then if I'm out late, it's a panic button. Get home in an instant. Plus, there might be new stuff as well that the mod has added. So, that's the other thing. If I was amazing at Blackjack... I would do the blackjack minigame, but I am not, so. I'm relying on R and Jesus here to take the wheel. Dude, stop with the parsnips, any other one. Imagine if I just slowly get there, just past it, past it, past it. I feel like I might at this point. Like I'm almost at ten thousand, and that's just as a result of just constant parsnips. Yeah, parsnip again. Yeah. Don't worry about the other jackpots. <laughs> I did warn you guys, like, a few days ago, that this was going to happen. That there would be a stream where I'd be at this casino just trying to get that jackpot so then I can get the totems and never have to worry about getting home on time. Or late, I should say. It was going to happen. Wario has a problem, he's spending Christmas in a casino. You know what? Give me a sec. I'm gonna I'm gonna do I'm gonna do I'm gonna do a little production valley. Just to represent like 
don't don't be scared. Don't be scared of the gigantic warrior. There we go. <laughs> now... Now it's truly warrior gambling. <laughs> I can't believe I haven't gotten any other one. Three in a row. The times I played with Cat, she got it in like 10 minutes. I, I remember. And I, I was there basically the whole day and got nothing. Because time progresses in multiplayer, unfortunately. Ugh. Say... Part of me is thinking I should move machines, but, like, if I do that, I'm, I'm just straight- I have the gambler's mentality there. That's, like, just such a stupid thing to believe that, like, moving machines is gonna help me. Because it won't. <laughs> Even as a little kid in Pokemon Red and Blue, I used to think that. When you had to go to, um... What city was it? I think it was Celadon, where the gambling corner was. And you had the slot machines, and then you would save your coin, and you'd be able to get Dratini through it. And I always used to just, uh, as a kid, just find the machine that won and then stick to it. <laughs> like, man, that's a, that's a horrible thing. Just that, that mindset. Uh, for the record, like in real life, I I don't gamble. Never have. N never will. I just don't have an interest in it. But in games, I'll hit my head against that brick wall over and over again. Especially if there's a huge advantage to be gained. Okay, that's a little better. That's... <laughs> that's... I mean, it's not parsnip, but... It's like... It's it's an increase. Damn it. I'm sorry that, like, the stream is gonna be this for, like... T as long as it is. 20 minutes, I would imagine. If I was to take a guess. <laughs> Pass it! Parsnip! Yes! Is anyone good at blackjack? Like, they feel like they could carry me to a victory. And maybe expedite this process. 
Because that is the other alternative, and then I don't know what the high roller table was. Like, what game it was. It's new content, so I'm not sure how it works. I'm pretty sure the blackjack one would be blackjack. You work in the casino dealing it for six years. Gotcha. I mean, if you want to give it a crack, just tell me how to play. Like, when to stay and when to hit. I know that I know how the game works, it's just the nuances of victory, that's the thing. But Will, the jackpot's just around the corner. How can you leave this machine that's constantly be been giving you parsnips? It's all about what the dealer's card is as to when you stick to hit it. Yeah, I mean... Okay, I'll do five more rolls and then let's check out Blackjack. Because it's new content. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. It's just another- okay. Yeah, it may also be semi here as kids in Xmas. Alright, but like, maybe I can cope. Okay. Alright, so, 10, dealer has a 6, hit. 18, that's gotta be stay, right? Cool. Double or nothing? Uh, hit. Hit. Damn it. <laughs> okay, I bricked it. Hit. Uh, what do you think? Hit or stay? It's 15. If the deal is 3 to 6 on most, the dealer has 7 plus or a 2 or ace to stay. Okay. 12, 19, A. <laughs> okay, hit. Hit. Stand. Oh, th yeah, this is- this is going amazingly. <laughs> Stay! It's 16. I feel like if I hit, I'm gonna- I'm gonna... Stay on 16? Alright. <laughs> 21! Uh, yes! Hit. Okay, 18 is, is a stay. 14. 16. Okay, there we go. There we go. Double or nothing. Okay, hit. 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 Stay. Good. I can double or nothing again. Okay, hit. Stay. Oh, okay, no, we're fine. Double or nothing. Hit. Damn it! Ugh. Okay. Hit. Hit. Damn it. Hit. Stay. I mean... If you keep a chain... This is like, about chaining. If you can chain it... You could arguably do this quicker than the slot machines. But I don't know. Stay. Wait, what? 
How did the dealer get a 16? As a card. What the fuck was that? <laughs> How did the dealer get a 16 as a card? Am I missing something, or is is that not correct? <laughs> you saw a 12 and a 19 too. Oh. What if this has different... What if this is, like, different? Uh, hit. Oh, stay. Nah. Wait, what? Why? <laughs> the dealer could have just... Okay. Stay. Damn it. Uh, alright. I don't know, I feel like... I'm still not convinced this is quicker than the slot machines. Like, I'd have to get some massive chain going. I'll have one more go, so this is the final, like, attempt. I'll just keep going double or nothing. Okay, L last, actual last one. I didn't want to bust that early. Okay. This is weird. Sure. I need a blackjack expert. <laughs> like, just sitting right next to me and telling me, hey, click these buttons, do it. Stand. I know that there's luck involved at the end of the day, but like... Double or nothing. Good. All right, I'm done. I'm going back to the slot machines. Although, I'll tell you what, we got a high roller thing. I want to see what this is. Thousand coin. Oh, this is like... Interesting. This is high roller, Blackjack. This might be a better way to do this. Oh. Good luck with the gambling. Need to go for Christmas lunch. No worries, is it, Twitch yet? Well, thanks for popping in. Let's hope I'm not here uh, all day. Ah, <laughs> uh, I mean, look, let's just... It's fine. I'll I'll cope. Twenty one. The dealer has to stay on seventeen or above. They are not allowed to take a card on nineteen. I mean, I don't think I don't think the person that made this knows that. I don't think they have the knowledge that uh that's a rule. Fuck. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Look. I mean, there's too much. There's too much RNG involved. Back to- back to this. It also, yeah, it, it seems a little inconsistent, especially, you know, when, um, the number 16 comes out in a game of blackjack on a single card. <laughs> That's... That doesn't bode well. I feel like I could have earned the same. The, the problem with that is I have to keep doing double or nothing. And it's kind of like if you follow odds for me to get to a point where I'm earning as much as one of these jackpots, the odds of that happening are pretty low. I'm better off doing this, I'm pretty sure. Because this is just constant revenue coming in. Whereas in the other one relies on just like... 
It's such a low chance, and I have to bail, and then it's just adding up. It's nah. I got the right idea. This is the one. Maybe the high roller table doing like chains of three would be good, but it's still like if I'm getting parsnips here constantly, there's, there's no point. Also, I just realized I had the warrior on the screen the whole time. So, yeah, sorry if that was blocking things and made things look weird. I've completely forgot. <laughs> so, I'm like walking around with this warrior on the screen. I was just doing it for this part here. My bad. Sorry. But you got to understand, it's uh, really late here. I have an idea. Hold on, hold on. Eat this. Because that's gonna increase luck. And I'm pretty sure luck is involved in this, the stat. So with this, I have a higher base luck. Hopefully that'll ha affect it. And even if it doesn't, oh well. <laughs> I mean, you would have to believe that it has some effect. If I could get, like, any one of you to click this button, I bet you the jackpot would happen. Like, if you were to be here, and I'd be like, just push the button, you would probably get the jackpot. That's my luck. And then, afterwards, I'd go to the mines and get, like, four of the, uh... <laughs> uh just four of any rare item. It'll happen. Whether it's sprinklers... Or, like... Gatherers. Just need one more cherry. <laughs> That's it. Oh, come on. You try- wait, I'm making you want to play this in Tara again, but also trying to get through Elden Ring with limited playtime. Yeah, get through Elden Ring, then you can reward yourself with playing something a bit more chill. Especially if you're going to 100% Elden Ring, let me tell you. There are certain parts of it that will just make you want to pull your hair out. I know there were, there were times where, like, I had to take a day break between, or two, between streams of Elden Ring, because I just couldn't do it. I was like, I, I can't. <laughs> I love the game. It was fun. Um, but, man, there were some fights that it took a lot out of me. So, you know, I, I, I'm playing relaxing games for a while. As I, I, I finished most of the difficult things I was playing this year slash doing, with the exception of Isaac, which is still going, but... Not too fussed about that right now.
Okay, I'll tell you what. Hold on. For those that aren't in Discord, end of year highlight reel is at this address. <laughs> Watch it later. Not now, but. It's pretty fun to put that one together. I know it's long, but I've, I've split it up into chapters, so you can browse whatever you feel. Or slowly watch the, the thing. It's a movie length special. <laughs> There's also some stuff in there that you may not have seen. As it, w it did not happen on stream. Things you hate in Elden Ring. Rune bears and lobster. The rune bear, once you know how it works, it, it's not too bad. But the first time I came across one, yeah, I got mauled. Like, expectedly. <laughs> so bad. But, um, you do figure out how it works. Although, I'm not sh you know what? I figured it out because I was a melee character, but I'm not sure what you would do as a caster for a rune bear. Uh, I guess probably the same thing, but just with spells. I didn't bother fighting lobsters much. Let's see, for me, excluding the elephant in the room of a boss, um, was probably those things that have, like, those insect-looking things that have heat-seeking missiles. I'd say they were definitely the worst enemy I came across, because they did so much damage. Just basically anything in Kaled, just <laughs> suffering. Anything in Kaled was just suffering, that region. Faith caster, what you do when you see a rune bear is kiss your ass goodbye. So you don't have anything that you can do close range. Because I'm I mean the the trick with melee was just you just kinda stay close to him and just kind of roll under him or jump. So you just pretty much stick literally stick to his ass. Like I mean that quite literally. You stay on his ass, and then his attacks miss you, more or less. I mean, the camera does get awkward at times, but it was the most reliable way I found to beat him. You do, but it's hard to get it right, as you meant to hug its ball sack. Yeah, no, it's like, you're not wrong. That's That's pretty much what you have to do. Dude. Ah, I have the worst luck when it comes to this. And anyone, anyone else would have gotten this jackpot already. Anyone. Anyone else would have gotten this jackpot already. I guess all I can do is make conversation as I do this. <sighs> On the topic of Souls games... Ugh, dude. I really, really want them to... Do... Give Bloodborne the remaster treatment. Because I haven't played it and I've heard a lot of good things about it and... It's part of the PlayStation 5's, um... PS4 collection that you get for free if you have PlayStation Plus. So I could play it. There's nothing stopping me. The problem is it runs at 30 FPS and it's it didn't receive the I guess the fidelity update that all the other PS4 games in that collection got, so they run better on the PS5. For whatever reason, I'm not sure. 
So the whole time I'm just worried that I'm going to start playing that game and then they're going to be like, oh yeah, it's time. Um, but I've heard really good things about Bloodborne. There it is! Okay. Um, let me just see what this can buy. Wait, you can buy a statue of treasure? It gives you gems? This is new. So there is new stuff. Alright, we're not done, chat. I, I hate to say it, but like... Unfortunately, this, this has kind of changed it a bit as I basically am losing 12,500 on this, and then I'm losing this, and then this. So, I mean, that leaves me with 39, but it's not quite enough to... Oh yeah, and the top hat for it. The, it's not quite enough because I want hardwood fencing, and I want a bunch of totems, so this is not enough. To get me in enough to the point where, like, I'm just teleporting anytime I want comfortably. <laughs> I know, I know I'm being greedy. But, like, it just makes the quality of life of the rest of the playthrough just so much better. If you just have, like, 500 totems. Yes! <laughs> it happened. It happened again. Right away. I'm gonna do it again. I'm being greedy, but I, I have to. That was quick. It's still not the bottom jackpot, but... I mean, it's the equivalent of getting a diamond, effectively. We get the stuff and then never return. I'm surprised I got it that quickly. Okay, you know what? Let me see how much it's bought me. Okay, so... I mean, hardwood fence, I would want, like... Roughly... That amount? And then... Let's just see how much this buys me. Yeah, see, I'll, I'll, I'm already down to 7,800. Not enough. And I only got 110. I know that sounds like a lot, but believe me, it's not when you're using it constantly. When you're using it constantly, it is not a lot. Like, I want to get to a point where any excuse and I'm going to use it. But, I mean, it's good. One more jackpot will probably do it. Well, provided it's the bottom three. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> uh. I always feel self-conscious when I'm doing stuff like this, being stubborn.
Like, if I wasn't playing this on stream, I would do this until I... I had, like, a thousand of those totems. But, because I'm streaming, like, I can't do that to... I can't do that. I can't. I just... I have this feeling that it's just, like, a ticking time bomb. In terms of, like, how much people are willing to watch this. Nearly. We're just judging for gambling on Jesus' birthday. Well, see, I'm not. Found them. Technically not. Because it's the 26th in Australia. So, haha. -ha. I found a loophole. And I most definitely haven't been doing this for an hour, so... I started this on the 26th. Everyone knows Jesus was born in Ohio. Yeah, and he had an American accent. Blonde hair, blue eyes. You can know, declare America the, the chosen land. Ah, uh, dear. Just one more jackpot, and then I can leave, and then I'll have all the totems I could ever want, and... Ugh, man. That's what the gambling addicts say. Yeah, they all want totems. I mean, I have exhibited certain things that, like, gamblers have, but... Like, to make it crystal clear, I, I have never gambled in my life and don't plan to. I just- I have zero interest in it. However, when it comes to games, it's a completely different story. <laughs> I'll hit my head against that brick wall, it's not costing me anything except time. <laughs> Which... I guess is money, but, you know. It'll make the rest of my playthrough that much better. Okay. Um, let's see how many it's going to buy me. I don't think it's enough. Yeah, that only got me 25. That's nothing. I want to teleport everywhere. Yes. Ugh. <laughs> uh. I promise I'll do the voice less next year. That's just because I've played Warrior games recently. 
And it's funny to me. Unless Nintendo announces a Warrior game next year, which then, well, hands are tied. I kind of hope they do. It's been a long time since they've done Warrior Land. WarioWare, like, sure it counts, but it's not the same thing. Yet, like... Five hours of that game, and then it's kind of... You've done the story content, and then you just... It's a minigame machine, so it's, it's not quite the same. I would do the blackjack game a bit more if, if I trusted it, but like, after seeing that number 16 appear, <laughs> I think I'm good. I'm just trying to think like what they could have done for that to happen, like, it's weird. What kind of dodgy casino is this? Because even when you take Jack, Queen, and King into account, like let's say they were worth 11, 12, and 13, it still doesn't get to 16. Yeah, that's nothing. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> uh. Okay, I'll tell you what. I will I will put a time box on this. Let's say six minutes, so then it, it rounds it up to like the half hour. I'll sit here for six more minutes and then I'll I promise you I will I will go and continue my day and just do this. At another day. Because I, I think we have been here for a while. <laughs> okay, now it's five minutes, so don't stress. <laughs> goes to sleep immediately and comes back the next day. Listen, I, I, even even if I was to be like stubborn and not keep my promise, I can only be up for so much longer anyway, as it is late here. So there is a finite amount of time that I can dedicate to this. As I will probably pass out from exhaustion at a certain point. So either way, I mean, it's numbered. Damn it. <laughs> Almost had five digits for a while. It's just going, it's just going up and down over and over again. Watch it go back up now. Yep. Ah, oh no, now it's five digits, but it's probably, okay.
Okay, I have three minutes left. Three minutes to get the jackpot one more time. I wish you could skip this animation, but I get it. Like, it really wants you to experience the depravity. I also gotta remember to remove the warrior from the screen once I'm done. That's <laughs> just gonna be kind of in the way for a while. Oh, come on. Okay, I got two minutes. Two minutes, and then we continue the day and move on. I still can go into the mine, so there's still like another half of the day left. I'm watching the clock. I'm not really paying attention to what's happening. I'm making sure that, like, this is on the dot. Okay, last minute. Nearly over. Okay, that's nice, but it's not really worth a lot. minute now. Again, nice, but not worth a lot. What's gonna happen? Okay, last roll. Alright, I mean, I got 8,000. Um, I'll buy what I can with it. See, I kept my promise. Next spin was a large jackpot. Yeah, sure. I mean, as long as I stay in the thousands, it's generally fine. Okay. Um, oh yeah. Right, I have a lot of crap on me. But I guess this is the beauty of it, is I can go home and come back now. <laughs> it wasn't, like, there's no way to know that. It's like Schrodinger's jackpot. I got the jackpot and I didn't get the jackpot. Alien friend, yes! Get a top hat. Okay, um, I'm glad I did this. Okay, let's put rhubarb in. I'm still gonna go back. One sec. Modern. Okay, um...
Hold on. Where's the crab pot stuff? Oh, I guess I don't need it. I have six. Alright. Uh, that, 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 that. Uh, do I have seaweed in here? I forgot to remove Mario. Fuck. <laughs> Thank you. Yes! <laughs> Keep Wario on the screen forever. I, su I suppose it would be funny to put him in, like, the bottom, the bottom right. <laughs> Sorry. Bye, bad. I even said, hey, don't forget, and then I forgot. It's okay, you can blame how late it is. Um... If it isn't my favorite VTuber Wario. Oh my god. That would- that- I see... It would be great to do that, but like, you know Nintendo would stomp that down in- in a second. You know, cut- the, it's their IP. But it would be fun. Uh, hang on. Uh, I'm still gonna- I'm still gonna go there, I think. Like, what a- Ah, uh, Maybe I'll get hardwood, actually. Hide warrior as an inventory tool slot. <laughs> I think it'd be great if I could, like, get it on an animation loop. So it looks like I'm kind of... Like an idle warrior animation, you know? Like, he's moving, but not quite moving. By the way, amongst all my gambling, I forgot to ask how people are. Fun, Nikto, how are you? <laughs> in my my weakened state of just being in a state of euphoric gambling, I forgot to ask and be human. Wait, what is it? poison mushroom? Right, I've seen this before. Good, just woke up and had breakfast. Nice. I would ask what, but then it would make me hungry, and I, I don't want that to happen. <laughs> this stream goes way too far into the, the food topics. I feel like inevitably we end up on food at some point, and then, yeah. Veggie and cheese omelette. Okay, that doesn't make me that hungry. The word veggie. Even though I'm sure it's delicious. Oh, right. This is here. Red Baneberry. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna have to come back for more of this. How much do they sell for? Not for human... A delightful snack for birds, but not for humans. It's worth 480. You're making panko chicken and Japanese curry later. Oh, damn. Ugh. I love my, like, Japanese katsu curry. It's so good. See, so you said the magic word there, chicken. That's how you get my attention.
Okay. Hey, Lolo, how's it going, dude? How's things? Merry Christmas to those that are still in the Christmas time zone. Which I guess is everyone except me. What am I saying? It's basically everyone, right? You're all you're all on Christmas. I'm just the weird one. Um, I mean, I'll try and like get this to a single stack. Right up, right. I'll leave the rest, I think. By the way... <laughs> if... Oh, dude. I released the end of your video, and I have to admit, like... I, uh... Every time I was, like, going through it... I just... I put in when we were doing the Pokemon AI stream, and just the part where you're like losing your shit over the worms, fucking hell, like, it got me every damn time. Like, I'm still laughing about the worms, dude. I don't know why it's so damn funny. Think about your worms often. Oh man. I think it's just hilarious that I, I spent money just to basically generate you worms. Oh, I forgot to water the. I need to go and water the other things. I don't think I did that yesterday. Maybe I did. Uh, I'm gonna put these in the cedar. Uh, oh, it's all wild honey, which I guess I'll just make mead with this. Oh, right. Uh... If I have one cranberry wine for whatever reason, I'm just gonna sell it. Yeah, I guess got any plans for today, anyone? What do you usually do on the day? I'm gonna go plant these right away. Just chill, yeah. Nice. That's pretty much all I did. You got Dwarf Fortress, how you finding it, fun? I- I did one fortress and I thought I was doing so well. And then just out of nowhere... These giant birds just stormed the fort- Just decided to storm the fortress and murder everyone. Just out of nowhere. It's a fun game, but I, I need to... I think read up on it a little more as to how to do certain things. But overall, it's cool. But you know, just suddenly everything went to shit. Immediately. And there, was no there was nothing I could do. Like, just... All of a sudden, 
stay with that. You're preparing yourself emotionally to play. Yeah, it's an experience. Death is pretty common. I had a few dwarves die and I had no idea how they died. I think one of the problems that game has in terms of its UI is just, um, like it has the alerts, it has an alerts thing down the side, but it doesn't really, like they appear, but it doesn't stop the gameplay if something horrible is happening. Like it'll say someone's in combat and it does, the alert doesn't make a sound. And when you click it, it doesn't take you to like where it's happening. So you're kind of left there wondering, wait, where is this happening? What's going on? Who's who's fighting where? And a lot of the time, I just I couldn't find out where anything was going on. So that's like my one complaint about it. But otherwise, like I had a lot of fun with it the first playthrough I did. And by playthrough, I mean just like a fort that lasted four hours. <laughs> But I thought I was going to do way worse, so. Oh. That's interesting. Guess I don't have to buy those anymore. Um, I have crab pot stuff. I'm going to go put these in the ocean so I can get the ocean crab pot stuff. I need to also go water the big uh, farm thing I set up. Wait, this year has been recovery mode holiday. I mean, nothing wrong with do like I've said this multiple times. There's nothing wrong with doing nothing. I think it's underrated to do nothing, you know? Very, very, very underrated. Oh no, I left my watering can. I just realized. Because I thought I was going to go to the mines. Yeah, I mean, I need to get into auto mod and start adding those phrases. And I usually do it, but I forgot. That's the easiest way to deal with, like, that stuff is... Just enter the phrase into auto mod and I don't know. I've never understood why these kind of bots exist. The ones that like just go around to every single chat and paste the same message. It's kind of like you. Sh I feel like that if someone is going to multiple chats pasting the same message, like surely there'd be some way to automate. Hey, this person's clearly a bot. Get rid of them off the platform. I don't know. I, I'm i not trying to, like, armchair dev here, but seems to me like they all do the same thing every time. Um, where's my watering can? Ah. I'm sure it's dying in the backlog somewhere. You're not wrong. Got to prioritize the money making. Oh, yes! Beats, subscriptions, hype train. Oh my god. Papa Bezos be happy. You haven't seen that in a while. Yeah, I mean, some of them are getting through just because they've changed the message they've used.
I mean, honestly, the fact that there were two of them, I guess, just shows that the bots are kind of like, oh, this person's, like, got people watching. Let's, let's get them. I'm sure there's, like, some criteria where they, they go towards channels that have people in there. Like, not too much people, but kind of like at a, a point where multiple people can see it. I don't know. I'm overthinking it. Okay, uh, it's Jasmine's birthday. She likes fairy rose. I think I've mulched all my fairy roses to get more seeds. Uh, but otherwise, uh, I mean, offhand, does anyone know her second favorite thing? Before I look it up on the wiki. I suppose I could just give her that. She likes grapes. No, Vincent- I know Vincent likes grapes. Unless she likes the same stuff Vincent does. Jasmine, Nick, though. I mean, yeah. Jasmine. Um, it's alright. I'll... I'll go wiki. Or is it under jazz? What? Okay, it's just under jazz. Why do I call it Jasmine? Because I guess that's probably what it's short for. What else would it be short for? Jazz. She likes pink cake. You're correct. She likes pink cake and plum pudding. Which... I might be able to make the plum pudding. Not sure about the pink cake. I need two plums and then I need sugar, which I don't have. I don't have sugar at all. Um, okay, hold on. Um, okay, I have I have plums, so that's done. I just have to go get sugar. Which Pierre should be okay. I also need to do this quickly because I think she's gonna go indoors. Uh, that's easy. Okay, uh, now... Just get like 20, that should cover me for a while. I'm going out of my way to give a... A nice birthday present, because the last time I played this, I was giving out gifts and didn't give her a present because I ran out of them, so, you know. I'm making up for it. I'm making amends. Fresh from Wario's kitchen. Okay, plum pudding. Making her favorites. Um. Oh, I think I see what I may have done here. No? Okay. Whatever. Um, get- always go with the larger stack, I guess. Look, one gold pumpkin is not gonna make a difference, so... Bat, bat, bat. And put this in here. Alright. Because, you know, you, you refrigerate sugar, as we all know. Uh, she is at Two Willow Lane, which I guess she's with Vincent. I know the ones that have forage as their loves. <sighs> Sorry, horse. You apparently can't squeeze through here. Um, is it here? She's not here anymore. Damn it! She's going home! She's going home! Uh, I, I can't get the horse. Marnie's doesn't... Oh, no, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Jasmine! Jas! Yeah. <laughs> okay.
Yes, yeah, so I'm the creep running behind the child screaming at them. Beach hipster, come here. Good. I'm gonna set these up. Um, okay. Oh, this is convenient. Yeah. Okay, he needs. A oh no, I don't have bait. Uh, is Willie still open? He might not be. <sighs> oh, but see. Shit. <laughs> Guess what I did? Guess what I did? L get Lois! Oh my god. Guess what I did? I uh, I auto stacked all my my totems. And so I was about to teleport home because you know I spent the last. 40 minutes gambling to get the convenience of being able to teleport home whenever. But like the buffoon that I am at like 1 in the morning. <laughs> I put it in here. Okay. Yeah. It's okay. Um, is there anything else I can do? I feel like I need to do, like, another day where I do a friendship lap. Um. Because how are we going here? The thing that's going to help is once that final bundle gets done, but there's a few that... They're very tricky to get. Oh, I put them over here. Right. Uh, I guess I'll go chop hardwood for the rest of the day. <laughs> this is the convenience that I work so hard for. Oh, what do you want? Um, I should probably check that. What do the doggo fish want? Wild bait. Uh, that's straightforward, I think. Let's just, uh, do this. I'm pretty sure I have some. Yep. Done. <laughs> I'm sorry. It just it looks so dumb. But I mean, why stop there? Why don't they make a cat a cat catfish? They can't make a catfish because there's already a catfish, so they would have to call it like a cat catfish, or a literal catfish. Maybe another name like a meowfish as well. That could also work. Why just a doggo? Yep. Late night thoughts.
feline fish. Yeah, that could work. I mean, the dogfish is called puppy fish, technically. So... I guess kitten fish would, would be the equivalent, yeah. If you were to match them. This is great, I don't have to worry about this. I will, I will be able to make this. And they're here every day. I mean, I haven't seen what you can make out of this. It might be a good, just a good fruit to do wine with. Okay, and home time. Yeah, this is the convenience that I wanted and <laughs> work so hard for. Okay. I know, I need to organize my chess. I know. Uh, that can go... On the plus side, I don't have to go water that other crop tomorrow. Okay. I do find it funny that her favorite thing is the fish. And that was before I decided to, like, pursue her. It's a shame you can't put these in the, uh, the geode crusher. That'd be good. Oh, there's the ancient seed fern, which I actually haven't seen what it is. Like, I have this, that one, but I haven't planted the uh, ancient seed fern. Hmm. Um, there's no need for traveling merchant anymore, so don't need to check it. Oh, uh, well, no, actually, I mean, it's, it's still... Ugh. There's still the matter of the apples, but, like, it's, it's only a few days away. Like, it's gonna... They're close. Six day. Okay, fine. It's not going to be today. I just have the stockpile of cheeses. That I probably won't, um, like, get to age all of them. I'll try. I like the, the look of the mallards. Oh, I missed one. Oh, 
Oh no. Wait. <laughs> Are my cabbage gonna get struck by lightning on the other field? I feel like they might. But there's nowhere to stop it because it's like putting it in town doesn't work. Hmm. I guess we'll see that intricacy play out. Um, ugh, alright. I'm gonna go collect that wood. And, uh, ooh, pine tar. And then go mines. I gotta remember to bring a flower for... Why can't... See, this is what annoys me about the horse. It just... It's so inconvenient. It doesn't squeeze in where it needs to squeeze in. Like, I feel like it should just have the same hitbox as the player. There's just so many times where I, I just can't pass because it's just too big. Oh, whoops. Wrong one. I wonder how many slime I'm off from, uh, getting the ring. I feel like I can't be that far away. I know I left the horse behind. <laughs> it's, it's fine. Okay, I think I'll replace the fiddlehead fern in the fridge with what I have. As now I have a larger stack of it. Oh, I definitely have a larger stack of it now. That's probably all I'll ever need. Hey, look at this. We <laughs> can just do this now. That saved me like a whole minute. Sure. <laughs> from what I read in the wiki, apparently the clover disappears, but I don't think it means from inventory. I think it just means at the end of the day, but if it's on the ground, but I don't want to risk it. Okay. Uh, wifey, please. I need to get to fridge. Okay. Uh... <laughs> Why are they both covering up the bridges? Uh... Idea. Don't I have a stack of 
the mushrooms? Yeah, I do. Okay. Uh, take that. Put the seeds away. Wait, wrong one. <laughs> Wait, sorry, I'm neglecting chat. Uh, yeah, happy holidays, Rickneck. Sorry if, like, I missed it. I'm, I'm assuming that's, like, supposed to be a play on Redneck. <laughs> anyway. Uh, yeah, I mean, feed who? Are you talking about the cat, or are you talking about the wife, or both? Feed who? Am I going to regret this? Yeah. I... Both? Well, you can't feed the cat. I, I guess I can pander a dogfish. So... I don't know. Alright, let's just go. I, I think I have what I need. Uh, just matching with a fan friend. Fair enough. Maybe it's just the way I'm reading it. It's just one of those, like, words that if you say it together, it sounds like something else. Anyway. Guess let's just do what we can here. I take the fruit, yes. I wonder if there's anything else to this desert. I know they've made it bigger, but like, surely there's a reason why. Need to get enough geodes to replenish my desert totems. <laughs> They're looking a bit woeful in comparison to my home ones, but oh well. Ugh, man. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Come here. Ah. Oh. <laughs> okay. It's fine. I need to eat one of these anyway. I feel like I've been saving up for this house upgrade forever, and it just every season I end up spending my money. Just to get more farming stuff, and it's, it's just a vicious cycle. Hey, maybe I should just stop farming for a while, <laughs> get the house. Ah, oh, I blew up before I got a chance. Hang on. Okay, let's see if I can do this. There we go. I didn't go to the traveling merchant, did I? <laughs> I said I was going to and I didn't end up doing it. Oh well, whatever. The apples are gonna appear in like six days anyway. It'll, it'll happen.
Heading off next. Alright, see ya. Happy holidays. I feel like sometimes I don't sound enthusiastic enough. <laughs> it's 2am on the 26th here. I put all my enthusiasm into Wario. I gotta remember to take the hat off as well, like, the moment I'm done today, I said it won't be applicable. Hold on. Mine. I'm not sure how I feel about the statue that hands out these. Unless it hands out different stuff. But I mean, I feel like after a point, you, you're not gonna bother with it. Like, it's... I guess they can have stuff that has 5,000 gold, but... Most of them, are, they're just gonna be artifacts that sell for like 100 or so. A pop. Why, why am I being insistent on this? <laughs> I don't need this. I just want coal. I'm pretty sure I'm still in the red when it comes to coal. Oh look, no coal. Guess Wario was a good boy, eh? Oh, that, I forgot to I forgot to tell the story, but like, I'm convinced that it didn't happen <laughs> because it's just like, and that's from in that much disbelief. But like, um, when I was organizing presents, I went to a particular store to pick up a couple things, and uh, it's not this shopping mall, right? I'm using American terminology here, so it's easier to understand. But, on the way up, there was this hairdresser, or barbershop, whatever, like, I don't know what the difference is, but like, <sighs> long story short, they were playing Christmas dubstep, and it was like, every single public domain Christmas song you could imagine was playing. And then it was like, the start, just like, I don't know if you have these kind of people around, but, you know, they, they play that kind of music in their cars, and they have so much bass that their boots rattle. It's 
usually like very high energy electronic music. So like dubstep, uh, hard style is like another one. But it was basically that, and it was Christmas music, and it was so weird. Like, Jingle- imagine Jingle Bells is like, an electronic music... <laughs> an elec- I can't even speak, like... It has a drop, you know? It was bizarre. I wasn't prepared for it. It made me wonder if, like, they've done that kind of music for songs like London Bridge is Falling Down. Like, you know, the build up and then it just goes, London Bridge is falling down, and then the beat just, like, kicks in. <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, that's, that's more, uh, early morning thoughts. It was in the morning as well, so I was I, I wanted a coffee, because I was tired. And I just walked past this place, and it's just like, this music blaring, and I just could not believe what I was hearing. <laughs> uh... I guess I got another dinosaur egg, so that's lucky. Uh, do I need to sell a dinosaur egg? Maybe I even... I think I do. Hang on, okay, so that's the icon. Oh wow, I haven't sold one of those. Um, Dino egg. I don't think I do, because I, th I think it comes on the fossil, technically. So, I guess we're okay. I need to sell, like, a daffodil as well. Then that can just become mayonnaise. I will have... Eventually, a section where I will decorate my house and make it look nice. It won't be this forever. <laughs> Just right now. In the interest of uh, not passing out on the way home. This is what it is. I mean, I have yet to see other things here, so... Fisherman wanted puff of fish, 1,000. I do have it, but I should probably get another. It's uh, the new kid's birthday, which I don't know what he likes, so I'm going to have to look this up. I'm going to say just how good this is. How much do they sell? They sell for 40 a piece, so I'm gonna see how much their jelly sells for. So, I mean, if I can increase the amount it's worth, then... It's probably worth it. Anyway. I think I need to save a few in the fridge. Okay, we're at the point where these can now go. 
as, uh, yeah, I, I now have, like, a large stack of normal ones. By normal, I mean iridium. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make more. I keep forgetting to do it. Oh yeah, I have the other egg too. Okay, uh, let me check the expanded wiki. Well, since Sophia's up there, I'm gonna give her a fish. Pat Sophia's head. <laughs> I like that. Okay, uh, let's check the wikis. Where's the expanded one? What's his name? His name is Martin. Okay. Martin. He likes juice, ice cream, big bark burger. Um, you can purchase an ice cream. Yeah, the head padding thing is cute. I think... Do you do that with anyone else, or is this new? Because I feel like I've never seen it before. Oh, I forgot the watering can. Call it. I have to go check on the crab pots, which means I need the fishing rod too. And I'll probably need to just... Ugh. Just take everything. Now, this is the part that I'm curious about. Did the crops on the other side of town get struck by lightning or not? I mean, I would, I would assume they did. Fire quartz. Oh, right, and then I still have to... I forgot to do the, the thing for Sam. I'm just not gonna do it. I, I forget. Oh, he's not selling ice cream. Alright, let's just go do the farm stuff first, and then maybe by the time I'm done, we'll be there. I mean, I'm kind of making the assumption that this requires scarecrows.
Are you selling ice cream yet? Not selling ice cream! Um, I mean, plan B is just give him flour. A flower. I don't want to, I don't want to, like, waste all day. Uh, here you go. Plan B. He liked it. It's fine. I may as well open these while I'm here, I guess. <laughs> Such bad luck. I just realized I need to do the garbage can, but I'm like waiting for my money to hit 100k. I see that they're not worth it. <laughs> Sometimes they'll they'll cost more than what you put in. Okay, look. Um, a single blackberry can go. Okay, they're ready tomorrow. I'm not sure I'll, I'll ever put something in that back corner. Maybe more silos. But it's just way too far away to be convenient for anything. I wonder what those mushrooms are going to use for- Hey, Look! There we go. There's a slime ring. Perfect. Ugh, good. Now I won't, I won't be attacked by it. <laughs> Finally! Okay, my moment, what, hitting that goal? <laughs> it does take a while. I can't wait for these things to just be passive. Uh, I mean... The napalm ring is nice, but the slime ring is better. And then I'll just combine them, eventually. Like, combine the iridium band with the slime ring, and then the napalm ring with the defense ring. I don't know why I walked here. <laughs> I should have just teleported. it. Okay. Uh, sure. I 
I need to work on my consolidation a bit better. Checking my s okay. We're gonna go on a wood cutting journey. Soap out of speed, yes. <laughs> I'm gonna go to that forest that I keep just neglecting because it's just this empty space. Start from there, because here, I don't know, it's closer. Alright, start logging. Destroy the environment. I wonder if there ever is going to be anything in that abandoned farm to the left. Or if it's just that, just for, I don't know, lore or decoration. Nice chopping. I mean, not a bad stack for just a couple of minutes of this. Okay, I can do this for like another 30 seconds. <laughs> I'll just teleport. The power of gambling.
Yeah, there's quite the skew towards pine cones. <laughs> like, like, if if I sell half of these and make nine hundred and ten, like, why wouldn't I do that? I have that many, like, I almost make a thousand just by selling half of them. I'm just, there, there's no way I'm gonna plant that many. Like, even 182 is ridiculous, like, just, there. That would take all day planting that many trees. I mean, wait, where is it? It comes on the other? 1,370 is not bad. Yeah, I don't know. I feel like they need to vary the trees more in that forest. Queen of Sauce. Greetings, it is I, the Queen of Sauce, here to teach you a new mouth-watering recipe for my secret cookbook, this week's dish. Hey, ever have a bunch of carp lying around and have no idea what to do with them? Yeah, me too. Well, I've devised a great solution to this all-too-common problem. I call it Carp Surprise. It's quite e easy to make, but you'll need a lot of carp. Oh yes, Wario loves fish. <laughs> Uh Wait, why oh, I'm an idiot. That's rock. That's why it doesn't auto stack it goes here here. Alright, well this is nice, I don't have to go water the other ones. Uh, I'm probably going to eat, like, a bunch of time today just seeding stuff. I'm getting two more of these. Um, and I might even just get another seeder. Oops. Like, am I really using the recycle machines? I'm kind of at the point where I've used it all, but I guess I'll keep it. I'll make two. You know what? If I really, really want to recycle, I'll, I'll just put it out again. Where'd the other ones go? They're in here. I think this is more beneficial for me. Oh, wait, I've got, i still got room. Alright, I can still recycle, it's fine. I would say, like, probably half of these are going to go just straight back into the cedar. We'll see. I have to sell 15. Okay, they're vegetables, so it's fine. Doesn't count. I was going to say, there's no way Pierre's getting these. Okay, how'd I do? I got 20 star ones, so let's just do these ones and see how we go. Uh, where'd I put them? I feel like I had a few more left over. Hold up. Ah, yeah. I had eight. So, I mean, as long as I got, like, 36... No. How many do I have here? 
I need like 50. Okay, I need more than I think. Okay, to begin with, cell 15. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Oh, wait, I can just go 5 remaining. Okay. So that's the prerequisite done. Honestly, I think I might just dump them all in here and just regrow them. I'm gonna make money from this already. I may as well just ensure that I can keep planning them. I might hang on to just five. That stack of five I'm gonna hang on to for whatever reason, whether it's presents or like cooking. I'm gonna hang on to it. But everything else is I'm just gonna make into seeds. Um, I, I didn't do badly. Like, I ended up with more seeds than what I put in. And I sold 15, and I have 5 remaining, so... Okay. But the next batch is 100% going to wine. Um, these are still a while away. I need to get Caroline's friendship up, so then I get the tea. That's the one thing that I haven't done yet. Um, what is she even like? Hold up, I'm gonna look this up. If I can spell. <laughs> there we go. Fish taco, she likes tea. Tropical curry, summer spang, summer spangle, summer spangle. I'm growing that. Um, you need red cabbage for fish taco, which I am growing. So, but I don't really have anything. Otherwise, it's like daffodil, which I guess fine. I might just start spamming daffodil. Keep one. Okay, now I don't have to worry, now I have extra cheese press. Wait, do I still need one more? No, the six animals in here. Okay, cool. So no matter what, I'm covered. Wait, wait! <laughs> I saw. I still have milk in here. Piers now before I forget and it gets too late and then I'll go see the traveling merchant I guess
Oh. <laughs> that new kid needs to hang around more in town. He's, he's just always at the Jojo Mart. Uh, is, is she here? Okay, she's here. There you go. Oh, wait a minute. Is this at the required level? It might be. Let's see. Okay. I can go in there now. I'm just not sure if it's at the point where the cutscene will trigger. I think she needs to be there specifically. Hang on, let me look. Six hearts, enter Pierre when Caroline and Abigail are there. Okay, hang on. But where's the... <laughs> Despite not liking mayonnaise, fish taco is her favorite thing. Despite it having mayonnaise in it. It's kind of funny. Wait, so when does it talk about the tea thing? Hold on. Let me see, tea leaves. Oh wait, but now I need to look up the sapling. Sapling, there we go. The craft... A tree sapling can be created with a car, but not often, otherwise it must be crafted. Caroline's too hard event. Enter the sunroom between 8 a.m. and 5 p.m. on a day that's not raining. Okay. Well, that rules today out. <laughs> so I could have done this a while ago. Oh, well. It's fine. I was too busy looking at the other content. Nothing really interesting anymore. I never did get the fruit from the merchant. So the apples are like imminent. I just figured if like I could get a pomegranate or something, then I could speed things along, but nah. It's, it's really gonna make me wait. I'm hoping the star fruit selling will push me closer to the house goal. I'm trying my best not to spend. But I am amassing wood so then I can expand. Like I'm gonna get another uh, shed. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Wait, can the horse use the ladder? No. <laughs> I think it's just, its hitbox is too big. But if it... If it wasn't that big, like it had the same hitbox as the character, I'm sure the horse could run down it. And I don't think it's limiting it because the horse can't use a ladder, it's limiting it because of the hitbox. I forgot to go get my ring. I need to go get my ring. I'm gonna go get my ring. <laughs> Hang on, don't hit that. It's going to explode the berries. Okay. 
I may as well take him with present while I'm there. Um, what is Marlin like, anyway? He likes... All the slime eggs. Root platter. Life elixir, which I'm not giving him that. Bombs. Oh, he's a, he is a difficult dude to give stuff to. I can give him fried mushroom, which is probably easy. But I mean, if I'm gonna do that... Okay. I think fried mushroom is probably the easiest thing to do. Otherwise, I'm giving him a gem, which I could. I can make him a roots platter. He does like that, but I think I'll save that for his birthday. Wait, don't I have it? Don't I have fried... I guess I don't have fried mushroom. Okay, well... I guess gem it is. Just, which one do I have the most of? Both has, because I'm saving rubies. I need to give the dwarf as well. Ugh. Okay. Take your present. Cordelia. Camilla, our witch, sent me here to seek an audience with Marlin. You know, he's a legend where I come from. Oh, and I, oh, I already got the, the crab shell ring. Okay, but real though, like... <laughs> there. No more harassment from slimes. Yes! Okay, these are going in the house, so then I... I don't lose track of them. Safekeeping. They're gonna be in the chest with Lewis's shorts. <laughs> He's never getting them back. He needs to learn a lesson. Like, I might even put him on a plinth. Do a little bit of wood cutting. But, uh, I hate to say it, it is late. This is going to be my last day chat. But, you know, while I'm cutting some wood and unwinding, I want to thank you all for tuning in and hanging out. I will be doing more of this tomorrow at some point. I also need to finish off Warrior Land as I was playing that earlier. As the whole, uh, like, Christmas retro thing that I do every year, so. That'll be the plan for tomorrow. If you're new here, 
And you want to know when I go live, uh, following is probably the best way to do it. But otherwise, uh, yeah, I'm around most nights, you'll see me. Also, the end of year highlight video is out on YouTube, so if you're subscribed on the highlights channel, go check it out. I had a lot of fun with this year's edit, so I do hope you do enjoy it. And uh, for those that haven't seen my stuff on YouTube, just search for my stream name on there, you'll find me. Or you can go to shambles.gg, and it has links to everything I do. I think that's it. But yeah, I figured I'd get this out of the way whilst I'm cutting down wood. And I don't... Cutting down trees, geez, see? Ability to English just dissipating by the minute. So, you know it's bedtime for me. But yeah. <laughs> I did have a lot of fun with the edit, and there's a few things in there that are... Uh, Definitely have not been seen by anyone, so check it out. It's long, but it's time stamped so you can jump to a particular game if you cho so would like to do that, or yeah, just the whole thing is there. Okay, teleport home. I love doing this. Best pickup of today. Just being able to go home whenever. Okay. Oh, I should probably get that, so... There we go. Oh! Should we have a baby Wario? Oh, yes! Alright. <laughs> That's a way to end the stream. Uh, 21,000. And I'm just right at the point where I'm gonna get a new house. Just, like, one more yield. And it'll get there. <laughs> okay. Yeah, 20k off. It's not too far away. Alright. Well, now I have to say less, uh, other than thank you for watching again. Appreciate you hanging out. And, uh, yeah. I'll be doing more of this tomorrow at some point, so... Be on the lookout. Don't forget the highlight video on YouTube, shambles.gg. <laughs> Alright. I'm done. Enjoy the rest of your day, uh, happy holidays, Merry Christmas. Stay safe, take care, and we'll see you next time.